Hi, I'm Perry from Mesa Digital Marketing, and today I'm going to show you how to enable related products on your debut theme Shopify website. So the first thing that you want to do is log into the back end of your Shopify store, and then hit on online store. And then once you've clicked there, there's going to be a drop down option where it says actions, and you're going to hit edit code. And I'll include this link in the description, but this is a Shopify suggested um, additional coding for turning on related products basically for this theme, this free theme. And um, we're just gonna grab some parts or codes here from this particular link. But once you're logged in and you're able to get to the editing of code, scroll down until you see underneath templates, products.liquid. So there's products.liquid. You're only gonna have the products template line here uh, with everything else obviously, but you won't have this bit of code. In. So copy and paste that from the link I just showed you and put it just underneath product template and then hit this save button when you put in that new text. And then the next step is gonna be going to the section. So click on that folder and then add a new section. And when you add a new section, it'll ask you, ask you to what to title it and you need to title it the related products with the hyphen between the two words. So just related products, you can copy and paste that again if you're more comfortable that way. And then add that new section. I'm gonna scroll down to where we have it. And it does do the dot liquid all on its own, so just do related products when you create it. There's a little bit of default code in there, clear it out, and then you're going to replace it with, again, from this link, there's a um, link inside here for this code on GitHub. Click on that, copy all the code, and place it in your um, new, newly created file in the sections that, you, that, that related products file you just created. Then again, hit save and you're all done with the code part. So you're all, you're all done with the, the tough part. The next part is really just checking a box inside the customize portion. So go back to online store, then click customize. And there's a portion up here that says to select page, you're gonna be by default on the home page, and you're gonna select instead the products page. Oops. And then in the products page, there's now a section called related products and ours is already checked but you need to check yours and it will now display like you see here on the bottom of your product pages and you'll also have the ability to change the text if you want um, or to change how many products show and how many rows of products are shown so that's it hopefully that helps for you it saved us twenty dollars from buying a twenty dollar a month uh, shopify app and we think it's super helpful for our customers so thanks for watching we hope to see you on the next shopify tutorial